It's time for straight people to have their say. It's straight talking with Richard Dutry. <laughs> Talking the show where we never apologise, never retract, never negotiate, never put the toilet seat down, never allowed within 200 feet of your ex-wife without agreement in writing from an officer of the court. Sorry, I forgot where I was then. With me tonight is Paddy McGuinness. Hello. Hello. Our top story: despite resistance led by Liz Truss, the House of Commons voted to introduce a phased ban on smoking. Your thoughts on this, Paddy? Well. Young people. The auto queues there for a reason. <laughs> Richard, <laughs> once again, the only person talking sense is Liz Ross. <laughs> In Britain, we've always been free to make our own mistakes. <laughs> From the age of four years old, I've been smoking 90 a day. <laughs> and as a result, I was voted healthiest person in Bolton. Oh, that's not right, that's right. Yes. Yes, no, I have a serious respiratory problems. That, and that, that's because of the bloody Covid vaccine, which, as we all know, <laughs> was designed by Gary Lineker <laughs> to everyone poof it. <laughs> <laughs> it hasn't worked on me, oh, no, because as they gave me the injection, I was singing the national anthem. <laughs> and looking at a picture of Margaret Thatcher. <laughs> 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 Reading. What else were you doing, Paddy? I'm cracking one out. Yes, Lord. <laughs> I tell you, they were right to make me sit still for 15 minutes after that one. Powerful stuff, Paddy. Thanks for sharing your genuine life experience <laughs> with us. <laughs> Next. Lovely. Uh, Meghan Markle is launching her own brand of strawberry jam. Your thoughts on that, Paddy? I quite like strawberry jam. I think jam, you'll find your answer on the auto <laughs> 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 I... Oh, <laughs> I can't stand Meghan Markle, <laughs> Richard. Mm. And I look forward to reading that report in the Daily Mail where everything you see is true. <laughs> 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 oh, fucking hell. <laughs> Especially everything you read about me, Paddy McGuinness. Oh, how interesting. I'm not buying Meghan Markle's jam. I'm as likely to spend my money on jam from Meghan Markle as I am to buy Prince Andrew's... This is not good. <laughs> <laughs> Guide to not hanging out with paedophiles. <laughs> uh, I didn't write I this. I, <laughs> these I are all your views. I, ju <laughs> I just hope Harry gets shot of her soon so he can make things up with his dad. Oh. <laughs> That's punchy. <laughs> Go on. <laughs> Make things up with his dad. Who is, of course, James Hewitt. <laughs> I think you made your views, and they very much are your views, Paddy, very clear. <laughs> I'd now like to take a moment to welcome oh. a new member of the Straight Talking family. It's over for you. You can rest. It's our new weather girl, Jordan Gray's here. <laughs> Richard, you disgusting piece of human shit. <laughs> I realise I can say anything I like because you are physically incapable of hearing anything a woman says. Lovely <laughs> stuff, lovely stuff. She's easy on the eye, isn't she? <laughs> so what's the weather like this week? Well, this week there's been a lot of hot air rising from the far right, otherwise known as the Cass Report. <laughs> Dark clouds coming in this evening but no darker than the depths of your soul, Richard, as you wander alone, knowing that the last face you see before you die will be the babe station model on your premiere <laughs> in TV, as you auto-asphyxiate in the early hours of Christmas morning. Wonderful! George and Gray, everyone! Yeah. Oh, what is I would... I'd love... I'd love 
to get hold of what's under her skirt. <laughs> it's a penis, Richard. I have a penis. <laughs> wonderful, wonderful. That was straight talking. I'm Richard Utrecht. Nothing was cruel. Back to you, Joe.